Hello, welcome to another video. Uh, yeah, on this one, basically what I'm doing is we're gonna test. I've had my Mega CD in here. So I've got all my box consoles up there. I've not long tested all them. And they're all in protect, so I know they all work. Uh, what needed a recap has been recapped. Now these ones I've had on the shelf here for a long time. So I'm gonna test today the Mega CD one. And I've got a Mega CD, uh, CD two down there to make sure it all still works. So they, they've been recapped, Mega CD one has. The Mega CD2 has had a new power fuse and a new laser. So let's get down here, look. So there's the Mega CD plugged in. So let's turn it on. Let's turn that on, make sure it, uh, it's working. Yep, there we go. So that still works. It has been recapped. It's just been sitting on the year now for about a year. Sorry, on the shelf now for about a year. So that, there it is. So let's get a game. We'll pop again and see if it still works. Let's try. Let's put let's put Terminator in. Disc and manual up. So open tray. Because sometimes lasers can go bad. I've not put a new laser in this one. So it's good to know if it still works. Press the start button. All right, let me turn the light off and do a little bit of gameplay on this. We'll run it for a few minutes to make sure it still works, eh? This is a, it's a great game, this is Terminator. The music in this is fantastic. In fact, let's put music up a little bit. Yep, come on, we'll do, we'll do the first level. And then once I know it works, I wrap it up, put it back in storage again. It's a backup, it's a backup console from the uh, box one. We'll play it on normal mode as well. Oh, t t this is a great game. Wait till the music kicks in. Great Tommy Talavico did the music on this. And then he ordered his new uh, was it, television console. No thanks. Oh. And what we'll do is I'll uh, just do a little bit of this and then we'll uh, I'll just try another game, make sure the laser is working. I have got all spare lasers. When I bought, uh, bought them, I bought uh, a, bulk, a bulk lot of them. For the Meg CD1, Meg CD2. Dead in a minute anyway. Oh no, I'm alright. Got the yeah, you get a better gun now, look. Still looks pretty good on playing for a RF as well. Because my AV cables are all boxed up in other consoles. I mean, they're pretty cheap to get on really. They should get back another one. Right, happy with that. So that's Terminator working. Well, CD, I know it's working. Let's try one more game to make sure the laser is working. All right. Let's try another game, make sure it's working. Let's put in, what have we got here? Let's put in Sonic Mega Mix. Now this is a, this is a hack game for the Mega CD really good copy of it and it even comes with a, a disc and manual so let's try sonic mega mix make sure it's working that's going in start of the controller 
Turn the lights off. Now, this is a company called Retro 6 that do replacement power boards. It would be nice if they did one for the Mega CD. And the Mega CD, well, yeah, the Mega CD because it's a separate power board on the first one. They call it, what do they call it? Clean power, don't they? Like five, five volt, it is. It's a good game, this is, Mega Mix. Because you can choose your characters. I've gone on to continue. <laughs> Come on, let's just, I just want to make sure this laser's working. It won't work on continue because the batteries are gone. Let's do Let's reset it. Try it again. Let's start. Yeah, I want to show you a bit of gameplay on this. It's good. But I'm, I'm glad that the, uh, I'm happy that it's all working, the Mega CD. Because they, they ain't cheap nowadays and they're just getting more and more expensive. And the problem is you, you you get a lot of people trying to repair them and probably don't know how to repair them and they end up knackering the boards and ripping traces, tearing traces. So it's, so it's awful. Right, here we go. Come on. Because I'm sure there's a setting where you can change your characters. Press start. Yes. So we can be... Let's be Shadow. Shadows, pretty cool. And it's got all the uh, Kaminoa move sets as well, where you can uh, zoom into enemies. Get to the end, and then we'll. Uh, I want to see if the Mega CD2 still works. Oh, Jesus. So, Mega CD1 still works, that's good news. Right, we set, let's get the disc out. And that was Sonic Mega Mix. Right, so we'll turn that off. Let's get you guys down here now. Alright, so we're happy. We're happy that it's Mega CD once it now works. Well, it's always worked, but it still works. What I like to do is it's going to storage. I like to turn it on once the power's off to dissipate the power and the, cap, the caps and everything. Alright, so. That's the Mega CD one, still working. And that's my backup one. Right. Now let's try, what's I open? Because what I do is I wrap them all up, you see, on that shelf. Let's try. Let's see if this still works. Like I said, this has been in storage for about a year now. Let's see if it still works. We'll go on, we'll go on the, uh, yeah. So obviously I'm using, the power I'm using is an all-in-one. 
which I got off a guy in France uh, the years, years, years ago, this was. So I put the power into, not that one, that's a 32X one. Yeah, so with this power cable, you can power Mega Drive, Mega CD, and 32X. Right, well, I've got to get another a different uh, AV cable, which is, I've got that ready here. Yep, so that will go in the back of there. I mean, all these a AV cables are pick up cheap anyway, kind of like Amazon and stuff like that. So that's that's in. Plug that in into here. Red, white, yellow. And uh, well, I tell you what I could do on this as well. Is I have got where is it? I've got an EverDrive, which I don't always use, but I've got it as just in case. So we'll put the EverDrive in. It's got loads of games on it as well, and the SD card. Right, EverDrive's in. And also, what this EverDrive does, let me show you. I think I got this ages ago off Amazon, it's about 40 quid. But on this, it's got the uh, CD BIOS for uh, Europe, uh, Japan, and America. So basically, uh, it makes the console region free, so you can put any Mega CD game in from anywhere and it will work and it will do hacks and bootlegs and everything so it's pretty cool so that goes in let's change the av we'll get you back up here again so that's plugged in and it's uh, got the multi-cart in there or the ever drive change this leg on this point at the telly again there you go and let's turn it on to the AV thing. All right, oh, turn on the wall. Turn it on. So the EverDrive should open the kick in, yeah, it does look. So I know that's still working. So what you can do on this EverDrive is basically we'll go on select game. So I can go on, here's the, the CD BIOSes. So we'll go on, because uh, it's a PAL machine. Uh, Mega Drive 2, so we'll go on C CD, Mega Drive 2, we'll go on the USA uh, BIOS. And then what I can do then is I can put a Sega CD game in the PAL machine and it'll run it. But it runs it on this screen very slow, as you can hear. Do it to the light, okay, so, so let's play. Make sure the CD drive still works. Let's have a go on. So we can find it. The game. Oh. Let's do. And we're going Revenge of the Ninja. So I'll pop that in. All right, that's in. Light off. Checking disc. So the laser, the laser should work in this because this is uh, literally a, it's a brand new laser I put in this, which is the same as the Hi-Fi I got. And there must have been a standard laser at the time, single speed. Yeah, pretty good. Easy to replace as well on Mega CD too. Ninja. This is, I do like this game. It's like a Road Avenger like that. Let's have got a couple of uh, missions on it. And then I'll show you what, the, what else is on the EverDrive. So let's do it. Right, let's go. See, sure, I got it wrong. Turn <laughs> it again. I don't know if it's pressure to be on camera, but I'm not normally this bad. <laughs> Promise. Let's try again. Get past the first trap and then we'll try that ever drive. I'm happy the laser still works. See? Yeah, so, well, that's that game. But I'm, I'm happy that the laser still works. So, let's uh, reset that. It is a really good game, guys. 
uh, Revenge of Ninja. So what I've got to do now is turn off the system for the Everdrive, turn it back on, put it back on the shelf, and then let's have a go on a uh, on something else to make sure the Mega Drive and everything is still working on this. So we'll go select game, but then you can go on, let's go Mega Drive. Let's have a go, what should we go on? See, we've got so many games on this. It's £40 off Amazon a few years ago I got this. Let's have a go on Glay Lancer. That's an expensive game. The, the Everdrive's all right with all the games, but it's a bit like Amazon. You, you turn, you put it in and you think, well, I'll play on something. And for 20 minutes, you're looking through it, you're not choosing anything. I'd rather just pick a game off a shelf, and then once you've got it, you, you play it, don't you? I think it's been re-released, hasn't it, this? It's retro a bit re-released, -re I think. I missed out on that, to be Play Lancer is a great game. Oh. oh dear. Yeah, so that's Glade Lancer. Let's try another game on it. Let's uh, turn it so you turn it off, turn it back on, and the uh, Everdrive will kick in. I think it's got mass system games on this. Let's have a go on mass system game. So that game. Yeah, there's your mass system up. Uh, let's go on. What's an expensive game? We've got, I don't know. Let's go on Street Fighter. So we've stuck Street Fighters on here. Is it on here? Oh, uh. Maybe Super Street Fighter 2. Oh, is it here? Streets of Rage is on here. Street Fighter 2. Yeah. I'm sure it's a, it's a bazillion game, isn't it? Uh, tech toy. So now it's got to erase it off the uh, ROM. And then copy from the SD card onto the ROM on the actual chip. It's a very complicated game, it's taken ages. Tech toy, yep, told you. So. <coughs> two player, do I play two player? Reset button on the cartridge. Well, it should work. It's not working. Reset it on that. Oh. Right, let's try that again. I want to play. I don't think I've played on this. Options. Can you play it two play or something? Normal, yes. Okay. Yeah, so let me choose another character. Right. Let's turn it off. Turn the light on. So, 
I'm happy. I say, uh, Mega CD 2, still working. Should do, because it's got a new laser in it. Uh, the caps are okay on that one, but it's been in storage for a year. So I'm happy that still works. And then the... Uh, the lovely, oh God, it's sexy in it. Lovely Mega CD one. Still works as well, which I've got. I've got one up there as well, box, but that one's that one's immaculate. That one is, and I've got another Mega CD two here, which uh, I have tested that not long ago. That still works, and then I don't see there. This is an interesting one. I get a better angle there. That's a Mega CD two. It's a tech. It's the tech toy one. So it's got tech toy underneath. It's grey. The bottom of it's grey. Bottom half of the shell, uh, and it's yeah. I've got. I've never seen one before. So that's a really interesting piece. Uh, but that still works as well. Uh, so yeah, so I hope you like the video. I'll do a few more of these. Does it still work? And uh, yeah, see you on the next one.